waiting for the flyby, and that's good news as well. Breon Brady with the basket. You mean the very first possession is that almost throw it away play and that's then right. throw it back inside for the easy deuce? Cougars team that makes almost nine three-pointers a game when they get their first from who else? Rob Gray. He's calling for the ball to block for the height advantage against Gray. Frazier with a quick seven points. <laughs> oh my goodness. Davis the running floater off the glass. This is a long road trip. Can they survive long enough to find their sea legs? Fabian White will throw one down. Samir Shayich, also from the Houston area, from Cypress, Texas, gets his first basket. Nardi, our bracketologist, as Davis knocks down another. Devin Davis with six points. And that looks like the Armani Brooks from the other night when he hit seven triples against SMU. Hatcher, he felt like that come from behind win against SMU, where Brooks was a big part of it. But they're going a 17 to 1. West fan back a deadly shooter and it rolled in another one. Turnover and loose ball. And then pull it back out and get that kind of look. Melvin Frazier, my goodness, look out. There's some teams who are playing for postseason berths, and there's Cameron Runnels with the hit. Davis, the Indiana transfer, will post one in. Mr. Midrange. Possession for the Cougars. Brooks oh. lost those long range shots. He's hit three triples tonight. But tonight, it has belonged to the Cougars. About to go 19 and 5, 9 and 3 at American Conference play, hoping to take another step towards the big dance after back to back years in the NIT. Kelvin Sampson's team wins 73 42 over Tulane in a game mark that really wasn't.